I'm Stevie Brock, I'm 27, and I live in North Hollywood, California. What's up? I was sitting at home, I was watching the premiere, and I saw the four. That is stiff competition. They're all very, very talented, and uh, I'm looking forward to the challenge, and that's why I'm here. When I was 10 years old, I met Johnny Wright, the manager of NSYNC and Britney Spears. I was signed to his label, I put out an album, and I went on multiple tours. Being a childhood star was truly incredible. Yeah, I remember having screaming girls everywhere. I had panties thrown at me in Flint, Michigan. When I was 13, this girl yelled, I want to have your baby. <laughs> I did the whole, like, rock star thing before I turned 14. That's probably where the fashion thing started. My style is bold. I wear a lot of crazy suits. Oh, you know, I picked this outfit out just for this. I came here dressed to impress. I'm putting everything I got out there. The nerves, get out of here. This is my chance to sing for America, the greatest country in the world. And I'm so excited to do this thing. Oh. He is shiny. You are so adorable. <laughs> Thank you. I love this outfit. Thank you very much. You did this all yourself. I did this all myself. Yes, you did. Yes. <laughs> he came out with a little box. He's lit. He's so lit. Can you tell us your name? My name is Stevie Brock. <laughs> yeah. Why are you here tonight? I was watching the show last week and I thought I'm ready to eat, like Diddy says. I'm ready to eat, man. Oh, he's hungry. I'm hungry. Okay. What are you gonna sing tonight? I'm singing Sugar by Maroon 5. All right, hit it. Sugar sweet, don't let nobody touch it unless that somebody's me. I gotta be a man, there ain't no other one. Cause girl, you're hotter than the sun in California, baby. Yeah. All right. All right, guys. Make some noise for Stevie. Megan, what did you think of the performance? <laughs> so cute. Uh, I love your stage presence. I had a lot of fun watching you. I love your falsetto. Thank you. It's just on the mid-range and the lower notes, it was a bit shaky. I don't know if you can beat one of our four, but it was, it was a good job. Thank you very much. Charlie Walk? I, I have to say, I think you're sweet. But I think an artist is a brand, and a brand is a promise, and I don't know what your promise is. He's real in here. They ain't no joke. He's a cold player, that one. Diddy, what's going on? Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, you know it's coming, man. Because I represent truth. Ouch. And, and I'm going to give it to you the way I see it. I, I could tell that you are a fairly decent performer. Did he say that? <laughs> I think as artists, we know in our hearts when we do our best. And I just don't think that that was a great performance. I just wanted to give it to you with love and honesty. And I appreciate that. Man, you're Diddy. I mean, come on, man. If I'm being completely truthful, I was nervous. And yeah. I think maybe that got the best of me. Listen. You can't wear a suit like that and be nervous. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. This is not the show to be nervous. 
You got to work hard and bring it. You cannot wear no glitter suit and come out here and say you nervous. No, sir. Don't ever stop, though. Don't give up. This is going to push me. This is going to motivate me that much more. Good. It's time for our panel to vote. They will decide if you have what it takes to challenge one of the four for their seats. Panel, please vote now. Yo, this is real. The verdict is in. Let's see if the panel thinks you deserve to challenge one of the four. Remember, in order to challenge one of the four, you'll need all four rings to turn blue. Thank you guys. Give it up for Stevie, everyone. Good luck.